Hello Blood Lovers, welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a new video, different, trying to change a little bit the channel format. Um, so as you can see in front of you, in front of me, we have uh, this beautiful bioactive terrarium. Okay, so this terrarium is from Exoterra and it's just Amazing, I fell in love with it when I saw it. And I'll show you a little bit of the features. Let's just compact this real quick, open it, and we'll show you a little bit of the features, okay? It comes like this, comes with a wrapper. Okay, so you just undo the wrapper, do all this, make it your own Pressing, this is out of here, all this, that. Okay, so cover it, really protect it, as you can see, put that to the side. Okay, so this is how it looks once you uh, are done removing all the boxes and all that. Oh my god, my, my heart kind of dropped right now because I don't know if you can see this, like with the glare and the light, it looks like the mirror was cracked. So I was like, oh my god. Anyways, so this is how it looks. This is how it looks when you... Uh, you know, remove all that uh, cardboard and all that material it comes with. A very cool feature it has, it has a lock. So, that lock, you see how it, how it doesn't open? It's really, really cool. So you just push this button right here. You see, it opens. There it is. Close it, push it again, it's locked. As you can see the top part, it has glass right here, where you can put your, fix your light fixture right here. Glass, beautifully. It's not like the other ones that had all the mesh all the way around it. It has its breathable area, which is this right here. Ventilation, which is perfect. There it is, click on that, pick it up. This is how it looks. This is how it looks to the bottom. Beautiful. If you're feeling lazy and you don't want to do um, the background, you can always put this background back here and it will look something. But it looks really, really nice. So that background looks beautiful. There it is. And then of course, you have uh, some of the instructions. You have items you can purchase at Exoterra. You have, you know, with a ventilation system I explained, the lockable, hinge lockable cover. You have a drain included, really nice. They added this drainage because you don't, want to, you don't really wanna drill a hole through the glass and you know, you're afraid you're gonna break it and things like that. So that's really, really nice. I did purchase their light. I purchased a Substatum, which is this one right here. I don't know if you can see it. I purchased that one. Purchased the Frog Pond. Uh, so almost probably I'll order it tomorrow. It tells you right here what it includes. It includes bottom drain, elbow connector, tap valve, hinge lockable cover, locks to prevent escape, self-closing, and all that really good explanation with all this okay so there it is okay, so let's see what we got here it comes with your instructions on how to connect it and how it goes and all that there it is and of course your valves this is your you know, this goes at the bottom of the thing. I'm gonna assemble it real quick so y'all can see it. You're gonna do this thing. So, there it is, this goes there. So your first connection, this comes like this. This is where the drainage goes at the bottom. So, there it is like that. Okay, so you're gonna wanna put this in, it's a little tricky. But you just gotta push, you just gotta push, push until you get to the third little top thing over here. Then 
Once you do that, you have that part there. Now what you want to do is you want to measure uh, the distance from here, from here to back here. You want to measure from from the from the from your drain hole from here right there to the bottom just give it a little bit inch to the back of your blade and what you want to do is you want to cut from there and then just another cut Okay, what you want to do next is you want to put this through here. Okay, there it is. Then grab your elbow. That's yeah, gonna go this way. Okay, grab your elbow, then tuck it in right there. Then what you want to do is you want to close this one. Okay, it's gonna be like that, so it's gonna be facing down. There it is, like that. And it should look something like this, okay? Something like that. Remember this is gonna go like this. Then this is gonna be connecting, going downwards. So that way you can release the water. I'm gonna show you how. Okay, so you do the same thing with the other one. You wanna do the same thing with the other one. Connect it, put it through there. Then, goes all the way to the back. And from there, the same thing. Close it. It seems a little difficult, but I watched some YouTube videos and I learned it from there, okay? I'm not gonna take all the credit because I'm not that type of person. Like I said, this one goes like this. This little thing, it makes like a little L and it connects down. So now, we are going to grab our bow. We'll connect the valve. Connect the valve, and then this goes up. There it is. Okay. See the valve? You saw how it closed? Open. Close, open, okay. This, make sure it goes tucked in here. There it is. So this, move all this to the side. We we'll need that. Carefully, and carefully flip it over. That is gonna go like that. And then this one is gonna go through here. See, there you have it. You see how this goes like that? This one's pointing downwards. So there it is. And then you have your valve here, which hangs down to whatever bucket you want to throw, release the water and things like that, okay? You might want to do a water test first. So that way you're sure that no, you have no leakage on this, you have no leakage on this, okay? Okay, plan lovers, so that was that for that. That was that for that. Kind of rhymes, but anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you learned something from this in case you buy it. Of course, I did my research before buying it, and that's why I bought it. Take care, don't forget to subscribe. Stay tuned for the setup uh, that I'm gonna do. This is gonna be a different video. New subscribers, you are welcome. They're very, very welcome. Thank you very much to everybody for joining this channel. Stay tuned for more videos. I appreciate the love and support. Thank you very much.